All right, hi everybody. <clears throat> Bonka 922. This chapter review. I should say both. Like this is just, just another reason. Another reason. Like you ain't reading Maggie and this series, especially now. There's something wrong with you. You obviously are closed-minded. Or, just don't know, you don't know epic shit. So, yeah, this is going to be Seven Deadly Sins, not to know Taizai, chapter 82 review. This had me like, whoa. Really. Like, when I read it, I thought to myself, what? I really did. So let's get into this. Asano no Taizai, Seven Daily Sins, Chapter 82 Review. Um, Courage Charm. Now, we, we leave off where we got laughed off last week. Guild Thunder cuts off Hedrickson's arm and saying, Guild Thunder, you betrayed me and everything. And he's like, I didn't betray you. It was never on your side to begin with. Um, now, what this entailed, this explanation, I, I still, I still can't believe the amount. The, the, this chapter was ridiculous. I, and by the way, this is getting nothing less. Than a five out of five. This chapter was beyond ridiculous. I just it, it blows me away. It really blows me away. <laughs> the explanation of of why Gil Thunder from the beginning of the series till now has been the way he has. You know? And just just it just goes to show you in this chapter the bond that Gil Thunder has with Meldos. It's like, it's, it's right there, man. It's like, you know, brothers in arms and, and fucking A, you know? It's like, this can't be broken. You can't. You can't break this shit. So, it was just a what the fuck. So basically, we, you know, he cuts off his arm and says, and says Gil, and, and, and you, know, you bastard, Hendrickson says, and, and he pushes him away, uh, Guild Thunder. And then uh, King's, I was like, it's skeevish, you know. And Guild Thunder tells Melodos, please leave the rest to me. For ten years, I've long, uh, uh, how long I've waited for this moment. So, to, and he's like, to take my revenge against my father's murder. He says, Gil. And then you see this monster twitching and twitching. And Margaret is, is, is kind of crying, and the person who I'm pretty sure is, is Merlin is asking him, how long have you known about this, Melodos? And Melodos, what he said, made me want to go see a doctor. Yeah, doctor, there's something wrong with my ears. I can't hear very well. Can you give me a hearing aid? And you're like, okay, sure. Here's the hearing aid, you know. This is a prescription. Go get it. I get the hearing aid. I come back. Well, not even a hearing aid. Can you get my eyes checked? Oh, your eyes are perfectly fine. I'm wearing glasses. When I saw this, I thought, I must be blind. This can't be true. Melana says to about Guild. When did you realize this? When we met in the Forest of White dreams. I was going to get up and um, like call a few people. What? That was like in the beginning of the series. That's what he meant. Diane. He haven't, he hasn't met Melodos and Elizabeth. 
That's when they met Diane for the first time in the series. He knew them? I was like, yo, you must be joking. That long? I just said, this shit right here got Melodos and Guild Thunder. This is fucking ironclad. Yeah, this, this, this bond is fucking ironclad. You can't break this shit. The fact that Melodos knew that long ago, damn. Damn. To the mangaka of this manga, what's his name? I don't know his name. Yeah. Hockey's probably going to attack me for saying that. Suzuki Nakaba? Yeah. Um. Give this guy a steak fucking dinner and a free ticket to like every show in the world. Give a million dollars. Yeah, give, give, take this guy out on the town. Because that's some crazy ass shit. I like what he did there. So, we get the explanation basically that, um, and I realized what was going on with Margaret just a few months ago. And she's like, what? And she's like, the Merlin. I it was Merlin. She shocked me on belief. Little Gil wouldn't co compromise his sense of justice. It was just... His life that was in danger, right, Margaret? And she's like, Mud Marlas, you know, how can I even begin to thank you for saving Guild? Gil. How did you realize that she was taken hostage? And he basically brings up the point, Melodos, your eyes are to discern evil. He brings up the oath, the knight's oath. Um, and saying, I haven't forgotten the day I was taught the way of the night. I said a little while ago, what about it? It's the knight's creed. But to little Gil, it's so much more than that, just that. And we get a flashback of Gil Thunder when he was a child at Melrose. Now, don't want to go over all that happened in this flashback, but essentially, this is him training with Melrose, and, you know, and Gil's like, I can't do it anymore, I can't be a knight. You know, I don't have what it takes. Pretty much he goes on and on with, with, with Malos about that. Skip a few times. We go straightly to, um, 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 and, 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 you know, Margaret basically tell him, you are you, you are the kindest and strongest Holy Knight someday guild. You'll be that. Um, <laughs> Malos is a funny line. He says, well, I see who's got the pants in this relationship. <laughs> Because she says, she like encourages him on and shit and all that jazz. So, then, so little Gil to his kingdom finding day. And, and we get this scene where Gil tells Melodos to run away. And, and Gil says, what's happening? Tell me everything. He says, I can't. If someone finds out that I told you, what am I supposed to do? And he's like, calm down. <laughs> Hits him on the head. And he's like... What, what's something you must do? Protect Margaret. That's good. And basically what ends up happening is during this flashback is Melodos is told by Gil, well, Melodos tells Gil, um, I'll teach you a charm. This. This. I was like, are you fucking kidding me? A charm to, to you know, if things don't get... If, if things get tough, you're miserable and don't have a way out, say it out loud. And he's like, a charm? I'm stronger than any of the seven deadly sins. Oh. My fucking God. Are you fucking kidding me? This entire time. I literally. Oh, God. And it just blows my mind. I'm sorry. It just blows my and I was just like, oh shit, you're cutting me, you're killing me, you're killing me. And this is the reason why Seven Deadly Sins is like, to me, the only thing that, the only other manga that has more anticipated ma manga chapters that come out than Seven Deadly Sins is Maggie. I'll get into that later. But he says that, I'm like, god damn. 
Uh, he's like, see, aren't you bringing with confidence and so on and so forth. And he's like, don't worry, little Gil. Even if you're ever in a bind, I'll come to your rescue. And he's like, sir, well, you know, he's crying and everything. And, um, and we go back to the present and, you know, saying that the charm back in the forest to write dreams, I understood everything that, you know, so on and so forth and must have been taken a hostage. Merlin, who's supposed to be Merlin, said, you were fighting all the girls against him. You know, saying you were going all out against him. He says, his little Gil was putting his life on the line, the one he loved. So I had to put my life on the line. That's what friendship between men is. I was like, yo, that's awesome. So, pretty much, Gil Thunder's just going ham. He's just tacking fucking <laughs> Yeah! I was like, yes! 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 Kill this one! Um, going ham on him. Uh, he stabs him, puts him down, pretty much. Feel now, feel my wrath. Oh, lightning shit! Oh, man! Then we go back to Diane and the others. And, like, this is Gil's first throw. He's like, Captain! No way, Captain! Yo, and then, oh, yo! <laughs> it was like, everyone's screaming his name. And he's just, he's just, no, I was just like, Yo! I do it. Like, that was so, like, very weird. Anyway, he shows up. We see Gil Thunder. He's hugging Margaret. Everything's fine. And it's like, I'm a little, a little, a little happy that you're a complete mess. And he's like, I'll, well, I'll explain on the way. What we need to do now is rescue Elizabeth. And that's pretty much what happens. And says, no time to waste. All come together to the center of the capital for Elizabeth. And it says, next chapter is going to be called Chapter 83, Crimson Pig. Now... Overall, I love this chapter, but it was just, like, mind fucked galore. Now, I don't know who in the community, I'm looking at you, Hockey, I'm looking at you, Anime Rick, Shiraz, and Justin. I don't know if you guys called this. I don't think anyone called this. I will be shocked. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I will tell you what. Anyone in the comment section who can look at me, can look at this video, and can honestly say in the comment section, 100% certainty they called this shit, I will send you an invite to Tuesday's live stream. Dead serious, which was Tuesday's live stream. I didn't see this coming. That's how crazy this chapter was. I did not see that coming at all. That it was a charm, and that's why he. I, I, I didn't see that coming. I was like, yo. No. One thing after another. Now, next chapter seems like it's going to be focused on Bomb because uh, it said Crimson Pink. So it's rather going to be Bond, or it's going to have to deal with, um, you know, Merlin. But either way, we're going to get that next week. But I, I just, it, he knew from the beginning of the fucking series. Held us is that. He's just that good. He's just that fucking good, man. That's all I can say. He is... I believe Seven of the Sins is a shonen, so I can say this. He's, he's that fucking G. You know, he's, he's just a G. It's... You know... You, you, you might as well put him on, on top of the list to character shown. This guy's goddamn, you know? But overall, like I said, five out of five. This was a crazy chapter. <sighs> Next week should be interesting. Uh Bond, Crimson Pig, we'll see how that goes. Nothing else to add. Bond Kai 922. Yo, I did just fucking kidding me. You're kidding me. 
This is crazy. I can't fucking believe this shit. Ah, I'm, I'm, I'm spazzing out. I, I have to. I still got Maggie to do. <laughs> that would, that would, holy shit. I got to talk a lot about that. So yeah, I'm Bonk on i22. I'll see you guys later. Go check out that channel. I, I put the link in the One Piece episode review of my other channel. So go check that shit out. I will see you guys later.